Hi, welcome back. I'm Kathy, and if you're new to my channel, I do food and product reviews, and I have more ice cream today, so I'm excited. And I'm even more excited about this ice cream because it is better for my diet. I try to eat low carb as much as I can, so these are Carb Smart ice cream bars from Breyers. Uh, make me happy. I can have some ice cream without ruining my diet, so that makes me very happy. So they have five flavors, but I only have three of them. So they have the mint fudge bars, the fudge bars, the caramel caramel swirl bars. They also have a vanilla bar, which is just vanilla ice cream with the chocolate on the outside. And then they have the almond bar, which is vanilla on the inside, and it has um, chocolate and almonds on the outside. I'm gonna start with this one, just because I think the mint will leave more of an aftertaste, just because of the mint. So this is caramel swirl bars. There's um, six bars. I believe I paid $3.79, I think, at Walmart. 60 calories, four net carbs, three grams of fiber, and four sugars, four grams of sugar. This does have um, real sugar and corn syrup, but it has sucralose also. So it's kind of a combination of artificial and real sugar. Let's give it a try. I do love caramel, so. I will say I have had the fudge bars before. And I think I bought these, I decided to buy these because they were the lowest in sugar. Soft on me. There it is. You see the swirl. So you can kind of see the swirl through there. Mm -hmm. This one's really good. With that caramel flavor or caramel flavor, whichever you prefer. Mm really good. Some of the other ice creams that I've had that are the uh, low carb or keto, it really has an aftertaste. It doesn't bother me, I still like them, but it has an aftertaste. But with this bar, I don't get an aftertaste at all. So that makes me very happy. This is really good, which is a caramel flavor throughout, but sometimes you'll get those thicker parts where the swirl is and it's even better. Okay, so the next one is the fudge bar. Like I said, I've had, had these before. 60 calories also, three net carbs, three grams of fiber, and two grams of sugar. This one has the sucralose too. I will put a list of um, the ingredients at the end for each one. All right, so I've got this, your basic fudge bar. Mm, really white, there we go. I taste those fudge bars like I had when I was a kid. Oh, what brand that was, but no. Like I said, no aftertaste with this one either. Um, I do, I really like these. I can have this and not feel guilty and not ruin my diet. So that makes me very happy. Nice chocolatey, just like the ones I had when I was a kid. All right, gotta get the next one for the milk. All right, and the third one are the mint fudge bars. Now with a fudge swirl, so I guess it didn't have a fudge swirl before. All right, I've not had it. I'll be honest, I am not a big mint chocolate person. Uh, this also has 60 calories, four net carbs, three grams of fiber, and four grams of sugar. Corn syrup, sugar, and sucralose. So, like I said, I'll put the ingredient list at the end. I will also put a link below to Carb Smart, their website for each of these so you can you might be able to see the, so you see the ingredients and calories for yourself. It's very pretty. See the swirls through it. It's not as a, it's a little greenish color for the mint, but um, not like I was thinking. Not like, not like the box, let's see. It's a tent, but that's it. These are pretty good. Better than I thought, because I'm usually, it tastes like an Andes mint, if you've had one of those. Yeah, that's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of a little, the little Andes mints. This is good. Um, like I said, I'm not a big mint fan, but, um, but I have to say it is pretty good. And once again, no aftertaste. Now my breath is all minty. Mm. 
Okay, all three very good. Um, I have to say my ranking would be first is the fudge bar, caramel swirl, and then the mint. But they're all good. It just depends on the flavor that you like. I love that they're low carb, so I can have ice cream and not feel guilty about it. So I love these. Like I said, I realize some of the ice creams have aftertaste, um, but I don't get that at all with these. And uh, Carb Smart does have ice cream too. I have not tried that. If you've tried that, let me know in the comments below what you what you think of that. Because I have seen it, but I just I just haven't tried it yet. But all three of these, thumbs up for me. Very good. All right, so that brings me to the question of the day. So several people have asked, what are my hobbies? And I have to think about that. Now since we're home all the time, I think about what are my hobbies. I, I used to really like to sew and do DIY type pro type projects, but um, I ain't getting more. My only hobby is YouTube, I would say. Is that sad? I don't know. I you know a lot of people are doing puzzles right now. Can puzzles be a hobby? I don't know. Anyway, I would say um, right now YouTube is my hobby. I would say exercise is my hobby too, but most hobbies you enjoy doing. I really don't enjoy exercise. I just have to do it, so there's that. So let me know below what are your hobbies. I would be interested to hear. And if you try these, let me know. Let me know what you think. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please hit that red subscribe and that bell for notifications. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe and I will see you next time.